What is going on guys and welcome to the let's play of Halo 5. Now I know I'm a little bit behind the curve on this game as I've been out for a couple weeks now but I have already played through the campaign and I thought I would run through it with you guys just because I love this campaign so so much and I'm freaking excited for it. But first of all we'll get some things out of the way. This let's play is going to be sponsored by Action T. This is awesome. These guys are really really cool. Please check them out. Links in the description. They make an awesome tea and it's for gaming. It's for gaming. It's so good. I've been drinking it non-stop while I'm playing games. Even when I'm going to work or doing Xbox or going to the gym. I love this stuff. It gives me so much energy and I feel like my shot like my my reaction time has gotten better due to this tea. Not even joking. So make sure you guys give Action Tea, like I said, links down in the description. Give this a shot. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cheap as well. And it's actually really, really good tasting as well. I love the taste of this stuff. I'm a big tea drinker, and this is probably one of my favorites of all time. And it's for gamers, so that's awesome. So thank you to them for sponsoring. But let's go ahead and jump right into this campaign. Now, this campaign is pretty awesome. I've played it through, like I said, all the way once. I played it through on, um, what's the second? Not not uh, not Heroic. Uh, yeah, heroic, not Legendary. I played it through on Heroic. Um, so that was fun. I did not play the campaign with any friends. I know you can play with up to two other people or three other people, maybe four total. Um, yeah, four uh, with the co-op, but uh, I did not do that. I played through it solo. It gets pretty hard on Heroic, and I'm sure on Legendary, I guess, obviously even harder. But we're just going to play through it for the second time on uh, Normal, probably, just because I don't want to... Some of the parts of the Jansen get really tough. It took me like an hour, 45 minutes to beat, like, the no spoilers or anything, but it took me a while to beat the last couple levels. And I think I accidentally hit the wrong button here. No, don't deploy me. Damn it. <laughs> I think it deployed me to the last mission. Yep, okay. So that's not what we wanted to do or see. So you guys didn't see that. You didn't see any of that. That, uh, that doesn't exist because that was, I believe that was the final mission or very close to it. Um, man, I'm, I'm rethinking about all the stuff that happened in this game. Um, really awesome single player. The story was great. Um, so let's just go ahead and load. Uh, yeah, we, that was the last one. That was on Guardians. Yeah, so let's just go ahead and load our mission select and start from the beginning. Osiris. Difficulty... Yeah, I've beaten it on Heroic. I have not played on Legendary yet. I don't have the time to sit there and do that. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Here we go. And I'm on like my second tea, uh, glass of tea today, so I'm amped. I'm ready. I'm psyched for this. I got uh, so much energy. Let's go. Which reminds me, Battlefront, uh, Star Wars Battlefront, you see that poster back there, uh, comes out tonight. Tonight at 9 o'clock, I believe, because they're doing a special event for it at my local Kmart or whatever. I don't know. We'll have to see how that goes. I'll definitely be doing some gameplay of that. I wish there was a single player for that game, because I would have done this for that. But uh, let's go ahead and jump into some of this backstory here with Dr. Halsey. And I won't talk during the cutscenes. All that much. I'll drink my tea silently. <laughs> I won't slurp that much of that. I was just doing a dick right there. <laughs> well, that tea's good. It's a spot. I thought Halsey only had one arm. Spoiler. I have spent enough years with Oni to know the truth. Cortana. Sexy bitch. Graphics in this game are amazing, too. Bum, bum, bum. So at this point, you're like thinking, like, is Cortana and Halsey got up something? And then the whole new fire squad, which is blue team, is awesome. Bum, bum, bum. Plus, I love that, that classic Halo music. That's ah, so fucking awesome. I really like what the 343 just done with the series so far. I liked 4, and I liked 5. And a lot of people didn't like 4, but fuck them, I did. <laughs> I like the Prometheans and all the PV weapons is pretty cool. Halsey is currently in covenant custody. 
I think there's a giant cut scene here as well where they were jumping down. It's the intro, the opening cut scene where we deploy off the ship. Pretty dope, actually. I wish you could play it like that. I actually saw a Jewel Abdama action figure at work the other day at Toys R Us. Fucking look cool. Though he doesn't play a big role in this game. Even though he's like a huge part of like the whatever that's the Halo whatever game or not the game but the backstory. He's a big part of that. Like uh, Jewel Abdama is like the leader and he's like the leader of the uh, the whatever army in this game as well. But he like dies like super early I feel like. Spoiler. I don't want to keep giving spoilers but I've already played the game through. Alright, I promise no more spoilers. Not that many spoilers. But this part's badass. When fucking, um... And I know it's just a big long cutscene or whatever, but it just looks so cool. I remember when I first saw this, I like shit myself from the, at least this trailer. It's like, God damn, Halo's back. F and A, dude. And I did want to play through this with both like friends and stuff, but I don't know. I never got never got around to playing the campaign at the same time because my buddies weren't playing the campaign when I was playing the campaign. They were all playing multiplayer. But I love the speed of this. I like how fast paced it is. It's so awesome. The camera angles are pretty sweet too, and it really shows off all the new Spartan abilities, which is awesome. No oh, fucking gets up there and. Oh, it's epic. It was like the eighth time I've seen this. It's still fucking epic to me. She fucking domes him with a magnum. I should have made more tea. I should have made two glasses. That's how hype I am. I'm getting hype. I want to play. Oh, the ghost. You should have never. Oh, fucking A. All right, now we get to play. All right. All right, so I think we come down here, we're about to get knife. Oh, we get the fucking thing. Oh, and right in the fucking jugular. Sit the fuck down. Oh, and then that whole squad gets murked. Except for this guy. And I Spartan charge his ass. Alright, let's go. Alright, so this is the first mission. And I believe... There's like... Fuck, like, what? Four or five different skulls? I'm not, I haven't found any, all the skulls or anything yet in this game. I haven't done that. I've only played through it the one time. But maybe we'll find some skulls. I know there's a, a bunch of... Uh, of like hidden stuff in this game you can find so maybe we'll find some along the way I think I found a few of them here and there but I always like using the magnum on the beginning of missions because it saves your battle rifle ammo for the for the enemies that are heavier towards the end and you know you can one shot most of these grunts and little Promethean guys with one shot Shh. And we can take out an elite with... Oh, they don't give you a whole lot of ammo in this, do they? I'm already running low. I'm gonna take up a uh, Promethean gun in a second. I have to take out these crawlers. I think they're called crawlers. Right, so I don't claim to be really good at this guy game, guys. So if you guys don't like how I aim at this game or don't like how I uh, take out a certain enemy or something like that, don't hate because I don't claim to be a uh, all-pro at this game. I just like to play it. Though I am decent at multiplayer, I will say that. I'm uh, Diamond 3, I think, in most of the playlist. Um, soon to be Onyx. Hopefully it'll be Onyx soon. I haven't played enough. I haven't been playing enough. Oh, shit. Forerunner soldiers pop right down. This is like the part of the tutorial where you're like supposed to be learning the controls and shit of how you can do the Spartan Charge through the stuff, which is pretty dope. I actually kind of, I really enjoy the Spartan Charge aspect of the game. Nah, uh, Storm Rifle sucks. I'll stick with this. Sit down! I actually kind of like whatever gun this is. It's called the Suppressor. 
It like ramps up the speed over time. It's pretty sick. Oh, with the biff. Push to the BR. Take him out. Where's the rest of the fuck my team? Where's the fire squad at, dude? Alpha team, where you at? I'm getting tore up. The cr damn crawlers, man. They're everywhere. Oh, shit. Look at this guy. Switch over to BR for him. He's down. Hey, he's shooting a light rifle. Light rifle is pretty fucking sweet in this game, too. Need some more ammo, though. Is that a light rifle? You drop one right there? It is a light rifle. Give me the light rifle. Oh, I don't have that much ammo for it, though. It's alright. Dope. I love the noises. The sound effects in this game. The sound effects game and Halo games are always amazing, but this one, this one particularly is awesome. Yeah, I only got one shot left. Make it count. Make it count. Oh, missed. Oh, man. It looks like I dropped my BR by mistake. Where did I drop my BR at? Damn it. Now I don't have my battle rifle. I was saving the ammo. I didn't even... I must have dropped it for the light rifle by mistake. I meant to drop my other... My uh, suppressor. Oh, well. It's fine. We'll just take on these... I think this part right here... A lot of people, right? I remember this was actually pretty hard when I played it on... The other difficulty on Heroic. Actually, a good amount of people show up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We may have we may have bit off a little more than we could chew here. Spartan charge out of there. All right. So we'll chuck some grenades up here. Shit's getting intense, man. Look at this fucking shit it's everywhere. Sit down. One more. And rip his heart out. All right. We should be good. That should be most of them. All right, that seems to be all of them. That's actually pretty tough for even being on uh, normal. All right, let's check out this next part here. Jewel of Dama. All right, so well, I'm waiting for this door to open. I remember this taking for a while, a while here. Oh, yeah, that's right. You have to go up top here. That's right. You have to make your way up here. Yeah, that's how you do it. I think there's some people on the other side of it. Open the damn door. Got some ass to kick. Uh, but yeah, some things going on with the channel. Uh, you, guys are, you guys are gonna start seeing some more of the Let's Plays. Obviously, I'm gonna be doing this one completely through to the end of Halo 5. Um, and then I'm probably gonna do, start doing some Fallout 4 videos if I have the time. I've been busy with work lately. But uh, I've been trying to get more videos out for you guys, but man, I've been really behind. And there's a data pad here. Yeah. I already found this one, though. Oh shit, what's going on up here? Nades. But uh, yeah, th there's going to be a couple more things going on in the channel uh, than has been going on lately. Uh, as soon as I get some goddamn time, I'm taking a few days off work uh, for Thanksgiving. I'll probably do some, get some videos done over that time. Um, we're looking forward to a, a collaboration with the John Gasm coming up or during, uh, during Thanksgiving. And then uh, we're also going to be doing, start, starting to get a podcast off the ground. I'm not quite sure how that's going to work out, but we're definitely going to try our best to get it done. Because I know you guys want to, I know at least a few of you want to see a podcast. And I actually kind of want to do a podcast. Can we break through here? I know we can. I just need a Spartan charge. If I can get like a long enough sprint. Let's see if I can get through there. Or actually that big ass gun blew it open. What's in here though? Anything? There's nothing in here. That's... That's real useless, actually. It's all right. All right, let's start and charge through this one. This looks like a scatter shot. Yeah, give me the scatter shot. Let's do some work. Oh, you should have never. Fuck. 
Fuck, I'm getting lit up. It's so cool the animations they do when they hop like that. It's so cool. Where's my other go? I have, actually have ammo for my light rifle now. That's pretty sweet. Team! And some of these, like, enemies are getting pretty hard towards the end or, like, towards the later part of this game. You got that guy taking out that big fucking uh, launch thing that's all up there. No oh, shit. He's got a light rifle, too. And these fucking things up there. Sit down. Thank you. I love the light rifle. Uh, but yeah, the podcast is going to be with me and John, guys, and we're looking for a third host as well. Um, we're not really sure exa what exactly is the plan or whatever. We're probably just going to wing it and see if it, see if anything sticks. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the podcast, if, if and when it gets done, I should say. Uh, and other things, like I said, more gaming videos coming your way. Uh, I know there was another week I started that secondary channel, the gaming channel. Um... K-Mac or k -Mac Land, I believe it was called. Uh, but that didn't really take off the way I had hoped. So I think we're going to move most to of the uh, gaming uh, uh, stuff back onto the main channel. Alright, sit down. Alright, so that should be all of the bad guys in this part. We'll go ahead and take this big-ass cannon here. Because I always like to have these things pretty sweet. It looks pretty badass, too. We can clear a whole room with it pretty quickly. But, uh, yeah, so there'll be more gaming, the podcast, possibly, uh, and then also the collaboration. I'm also trying to get some vlogs out. I need to get more vlogs out. I haven't done a vlog in months, and, uh, you know, I don't know. I thought I think it'd be cool to, like, just do a daily vlog. Not daily, but, like, you know, once a week, twice a week, maybe. See, just check in with you guys, tell you what's going on. What I've been up to that week, you know, what I've been playing, that kind of stuff. Uh, and then the normal cartoon conspiracy theories, obviously, the top ten videos, uh, stuff like that. Oh shit, what is that fucking thing? It's a knight. That's right. Jesus. Another data pad here. Alright, so we go this way. Okay, no, we can go this way now. Alright, so. Well, oh shit, look at that. Look how many people are. Oh, this thing kicks ass. Take out those knights real quick with it. No, I fucking melted them. Those knights are insane looking though. Pretty fucking scary. I just get friendly fired. I know you're supposed to for the knights. You're supposed to blow up like one side and then the other to take out his armor or whatever. But when you have a gun like this, you can probably just blow the absolute dog shit out of him. He's supposed to shoot like where he's glowing and stuff. Holy fucking hey, Tanaka, that was dope! You like disintegrated in her face. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, but this game is so much fun. If you guys have not gotten a chance to play Halo 5 yet, I highly recommend giving it a play. It, uh, it doesn't disappoint. And the multiplayer is fun. That's that's another thing. The multiplayer is actually really solid. Uh, I like it more than I liked Halo 4. And I actually pretty, enjoy, pretty much really enjoyed Halo 4 as well. But uh, Halo 5 is awesome. I love all the playlists and stuff. And I love the movement system. I've been really getting into that movement system. Like, pretty awesome. With the bluster and stuff. I'm going to have to make some more tea. For the next episode. Jewel of Dama. So is Halsey double crossing with Jewel of Dama? Question mark? I forgot about the Diadact from Halo 4. Our 
F and A, it's taken down. Oh, headshot. Oh, fucking A. It's some pretty awesome cutscenes in this game, too. Pretty hard ass shit. Like backflips and then checking them uh, an elite off. And that's Jewel of Dama. And like I said, he dies like pretty quickly in this game. <laughs> In a cutscene, so it qu could have been a badass character uh, or badass enemy to kind of falls by the wayside, I guess. Which is, I guess, it's not that worst thing ever, but he was a big part of the Halo lore in the prior, like uh, Halo Nightfall and stuff. He was like the main bad guy, but in this they just kill him off in a cutscene. But uh looks like that's the end of the first mission, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure you guys smash that like button. Stay tuned for part two. It's going to be coming to you very, very soon. Uh, this cutscene, we'll probably replay the cutscene for the next one. But uh, remember to smash that like button. Like I said, subscribe if you're new. Also, big thank you to Action T. Link's in the description, guys. Go check them out. The T is absolutely amazing. And it's really fun for getting you all psyched up and amped when you want to go on a big gaming bender. But uh, until next time, guys, remember this came back time somewhere. Peace.